my personal relationship to energy has been unreciprocal at best. It does a lot for me, but I don't think I've thought much about it. And don't get me wrong, I cared about it. I studied it, wrote papers on it, and even got politically fired up about it. But I really didn't think about my own use and relationship to it. Neither did my friends. Hey, what's your personal relationship to energy? What? <laughs> I'm not too sure. The bright energy action pack changed that for me, getting me to actually consider my personal relationship to energy and the positive and negatives of each source. I was surprised to hear about the pros and cons of a variety of sources, especially the greener, cleaner ones. It got me out of the mental trap of thinking good, bad energy, but actually encouraged me to more holistically look at the consequences. What am I doing now? Alongside with advocating for just, sustainable progress on energy, actions like turning off the light when I leave, unplugging things from their socket, and washing in cold water are all now part of my daily life. Do these actions actually do anything? I'd say that that question is missing the point. No, they don't do much at a global scale, but thinking about these things is helping me to be more informed, consider my personal relationship to energy, and thus amplify my potential to affect community, systems level, global change. And that's what matters.